The weekend's almost here and our Kirk Webster is back with some great ideas to fit your budget. Welcome back to Prime Time. Hello on a sunny Thursday, isn't it? I know. We should be out at the beach right now. We should do a live broadcast from the beach. I'm up for that. That's why I wore my visor and <laughs> I'll tell you all about the sunny weekend coming up. Right. Most of it's going to be Are outside. Are you going to be our weather guy too now? No, <laughs> I, I don't think uh, we're going to go there. But oh. um, uh, tonight, a uh, nice charity event downtown at the new Bailiwick Restaurant on Fifth Avenue. I've never heard of that place. It just, it just opened and they have an art show tonight and it benefits It's All About the Kids Foundation. Oh, I'm so, about that. Yes. And from five to six o'clock, there are free appetizers and little mini drinks. All right, that's a good reason for me to leave the show at five. <laughs> that's right. Appetizers. So, uh, give a shout out to my uh, friend Andrea Brandon. She's uh, it's all about the kids foundation, and uh, so that's uh, downtown, uh, as mm -hmm. I said, and that's tonight, and it goes until nine o'clock, and the monies go to the to the foundation. So, what it. kind of art? Uh, various artists are down there Painting. displaying. Mm -hmm. Some of it's modern, some of it's impressionistic. I, I haven't seen all that. the pieces, but. Yes. Hmm. And what else you got? And then uh, tomorrow through uh, Sunday, uh, over in Coronado at the Montgomery uh, Miller Field, it's uh, the Carnival in Coronado. It's not the Brazilian Carnival. This is a carnival for kids. And it goes from 1 o'clock until 11 o'clock at night. They're bringing a professional company. What, the, what are kids doing out at 11 o'clock at night? Well, they're riding rides. It's kind of like the fairgrounds at night, but only they're bringing them to Coronado. Hmm. And uh, it's only $2. So, yeah, but I, got, I have my kids in early. Yes, well, <laughs> I guess maybe they stay out later in Coronado. I don't know. Or but maybe uh, they're out we're talking teenagers, too. It's not just little kids, obviously. I would imagine. I mean, there are all sorts of things to do. There's crafts and music, mm -hmm. entertainment, and, of course, food and fun. So that's cool. uh, that's through, uh, for through $2, Sunday. For $2. For $2, $2. For $2, that's, yeah. that's a lot of bang for your buck. Absolutely. Okay, so what else? Also tomorrow through mm -hmm. Sunday at the fairgrounds, we've got the Spring Home and Garden Show. Mm -hmm. And that's not just all about home improvements and remodeling. They also have pets there, things to do, uh, buy for your pets, do with your pets. There's art there as well. So it's a, it's a fun event to do. It's free for kids under 12 years old. Otherwise, it's $8. And also at the fairgrounds, just right across the way, is the Gem Fair. So I thought I would bring Did you... Did you make that? <laughs> I didn't make this, but these are the kind of things that they can kids can make. Yeah. Yeah, they have classes on making jewelry. They have some of the G graduate gemologists from the GIA. <laughs> kind of matches your outfit. Don't say oh I didn't. Oh, my gosh. My producer, Andrew, just said it matched match my Indian outfit. This is a Western outfit. I had no idea this it would match. This could be ethnic of any sort. It could be, you know, African. It could be well, anything. I'm going to tell you where I got those. I got those in the Amazon. Those are made by the Watch. Amazonian Indians. This, this will look good. There you go. So don't say I never gave you anything valuable. <laughs> I like it. So anyway, but that's uh, that's uh, at the at the fairgrounds. You got a couple of things with the home and garden show. Do you the realize when you bring props, you lose them because I keep them? That's and bring well. Them that's why kids. I bring them on. I have so many <laughs> at home hanging from here and there. But uh, yeah, if you go on their website at the gemfair.com website, they're two for one. It's uh, seven dollars otherwise. Where's that at? That's at the Del Mar Fairgrounds. Yeah, I've been tomorrow to that. through Sunday. I've actually been to that. I took my kids, and uh, I there's so much there, and you can actually make these. Next necklaces that would sell for $400, you can make them yourself. Yeah. If you want to get your uh, gems and jewelry appraised, they yeah. have the GIA gemologist there to check it out as well. And my, so. my girls have a gem collection. They love gems. Well, there you go. And mommy loves gems too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what else? Well, I'll tell you, a gem of a day is going to be Sunday. I'm jumping ahead to Sunday, but up in Oceanside, if you are at the beach already mm. uh, getting some sun, if you want to go in for a, a chill, as they say, the um, there's the Polar Plunge, and that's uh, from 8 o'clock in the morning until 1 o'clock in the afternoon, and it benefits the Special Olympics. So kind of near and dear to my heart. Uh, it's Aww. $50 if you want to take the plunge, or if you want to plead that you're chicken, as they say, um, it's, uh, you can make a donation to the Special Olympics. So. Uh, as they say, freezing for a reason. So, but bring your towel. It can, you can either lie on it or you can use it to, to towel off. But that's on Sunday. And then uh, on Saturday, uh, it's the 65th annual Ocean Beach Kite Festival. And this is not just your normal kite festival. This is, you can learn how to make kites from 9 to 12, and then they have contests from 1 o'clock until 4 o'clock. So that's t t uh, Saturday, and um, it's it's that's a whole cool. lot of fun. There are all sorts of crafts, and there's music and entertainment and things for kids to do. It's really a family festival uh, more than just 
flying kites. So that's fun to do on Saturday. And also on Saturday, I don't want to overlook, but Chelsea's run and walk. Yeah, the 5K I want is up, everybody to Up do in that. Balboa Park, and that's a real great cause mm -hmm. for her foundation. Of course, we know about Chelsea King was attacked and uh, killed while on a training run. So that's going to happen on, uh, on Saturday. And you don't have to be uh, out there running or walking. Just go support, uh, buy some food. Some of the money goes to, to her foundation. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's on Saturday and a great cause. It's on the west side of Balboa Park. So, uh, yeah, that one, having, that one so, hits home for me. I, I wish all of San Diego would go to that. Yeah. And that's just, it's $20 for kids and $35 for adults. Just mm -hmm. go up there and uh, you can run as an individual or as a team. You can go against the clock or if you just want to walk it, hoof it. There you great go. Great cause. Fun great in the cause. sun on Sunday. Well, thank you. You're welcome. I love that. With so much to do. Yeah. And so all for bargain. Remember your sunscreen no, and your use, that's oil. sunnies. You know, there you go. Yeah. You. If you would have saw what I wore yesterday, you would need that because I was so bright. <laughs> <laughs> they tease me about. They like to tease me about my wardrobe. Oh. All right. Thank you, Kurt. We'll see you next week. Bye. Until then, we gotta take a break. Prime time. We'll be right back.